Hi guys, so this is a continuation video in relation to my last video about how to make preschool circle time fun. So let me do a quick recap by defining what is circle time. Another word for circle time is group time. So this is where children sit together to engage in an activity. So when you hear the word circle time, it's a group activity that the children sit together to engage in an activity. What should circle time include? You might be thinking for ideas in relation to what you can include in circle time. So circle time should include story time. Yes, you're reading a story to the children. You're encouraging the children to share their story as well about what's going on at home. So you can ask them questions. How was their weekend? So you're listening to their stories. For instance, if you have a child in your classroom, that brother and sister, baby at home, you know, they just had a new baby brother or baby sister. You can encourage the child to share their story with other children. How does the baby brother or baby sister looks? So, you know, this is all about story time as well. You're asking them questions. Maybe they traveled where did they travel to see what did they like maybe on their way to school what did they notice what did they see in their community it's all about story time as well so story time should move beyond you reading a story to the children it's not just about reading a story to the children yes it's part of story time as well but encourage the children to share their stories as well any news at home any stories that they want you to share with you so you can ask them questions does anybody has a story that they would like to share you see the children would just like to up, they'll be so happy they want to share their stories and you need to understand that children are curious preschool children they are curious they always have a lot to say so you need to be able to give them the opportunity to be able to share what they have to say through story time also include music as well yes the children listening to the music and engaging in the process as well they are acting out they are mo moving up their body around they are singing the stand gestures they are postures they are carrying out the actions and the songs it's not just all about the children singing which is important for language development but let them carry out the actions of the songs as well this is going to promote their verbal communication which is all about language is both the verbal and the non-verbal communication so time should also include music as well. Good time should also include the children using parts of their bodies, like they're clapping their hands, gestures, postures. So all of this should include circle time as well you could sing songs that has to do with the children clapping their hands for instance if you're happy and you know it clap your hands so when you sing the songs if you're happy and you know it clap your hands the children are going to clap their hands you could take it further by asking the children to touch their head you know part of their bodies to stamp their feet you know making circle time fun and at the same time the children are learning part of their bodies for instance if say if you're happy and you know you touch your nose the children are definitely going to touch their nose their head you know whatever part of their body that you want them to be acquainted with this in the form way to introducing songs that has to do with the children learning part of their bodies, actions, they're clapping, they're stamping their feet, they're jumping, they're running around, they're waving. So this should also be an activity that you should include in circle time as well. Are just some of the activities that you could include in circle time and you need to understand that in relation to circle time it should promote the overall development of the young child in terms of the physical which has to do with the young child using their fingertips their own body their imagination their language using words their emotion to be able to express their feelings you know their culture so this is what you think of when you're thinking about circle time it's not just yes we take the box that we have circle time it should promote the overall development of the young child in early childhood and if you found this video helpful please subscribe and not just subscribe you can share it with your friends as well your other educator that this video might be of beneficial too and come your way next time stay safe and mind yourselves for now bye